Then the Fire Nation attacked. Yeah, see, so you can see the purple stars much further back. That's true, yeah. So maybe that is a chin strap or something. I don't know. Or maybe that it's like a little bit of fabric to hold it tight. I have no or idea. Or taut or whatever. This young lady was of great assistance to me and my Pokemon, so I hope you forgive my bringing her into the village for a bit. Nod, nod. Yep. <laughs> Here on the D-pad, where I'm Rick. I suppose ah! that's, a, that's a good enough place for us to start a new one. Felt like a meaningful little moment there. Oh, hey, it's my life as a slime. <laughs> Seriously. Such a good show, though. Huh. They're doing that close-to-camera dithering thing. Not a critique, just a just a noticed thing. Oh, having a peaceful village life like that. Yep, time to tear it up, tear it asunder, and upend their lives. This is interesting, though. Usually, in most Pokemon villages, you see Pokemon around, and yeah. there are none, which makes sense because, as he's saying, you know, this is the first time people are like the, hanging out with Pokemon. The Galaxy, the Galaxy Expedition Team. Oh no, his frame rate. Oh yeah, he's kind of. Oh, and they're frame right in the background, too. Oh, that's weird. Everything's going a little funky there. Yeah, when you get... Cl so they've, I guess, decided... So usually in 3D games, when something gets far enough away, they reduce the number of polygons so that it's a, a lighter load on the on the console, but I guess they've decided to reduce frame rate? Oh, botheration. I'd almost forgotten. I mean, but Galaxy... an accidental coincidence. So Galaxy Expedition Team is pretty visibly just Team Galactic. <laughs> but in the past, but they're a villain organization. That ha that's not the first time this kind of thing has happened before, I feel yeah. like. I might ask you to wait for me at the canteen. So see that logo on the on the top on the building there? Yeah. If you get rid of the A shape on the on the top right mm -hmm. and the kind of like wedgy J shape on the bottom left, mm -hmm. and you slide that top left over, you wind up with a G. So you got that kind of like rounded I I guess it's it is the it is the Team Galactic logo, but with more stuff there. I'm not really sure what the other symbols, if they actually mean something or not, but it's just past this bridge here, then to the left, it, the Wallflower, it's called. You got a big pom pom. Heyo, baby, heyo. It just, we just phase it out of our shirt. It's cool. That's what I mean. It just kind of comes out of you whenever you need it. Yeah. It's so. like, hey, I got this warmth. So minus is the map guidance markers when you're exploring. Coolie cool. Okay. Neat. All right. The question is, can we do anything else yet? Or... I mean, it looks like we could. May as well poke around a little bit here. Actually, maybe we should wait until we actually have a Pokemon to, like... I mean, yeah, I don't think anyone will be able to give you anything useful until you have a Pokemon. That's yeah. pretty standard, you know? Oh, running is a toggle. Okay. Until you stop, and then it automatically untoggles. Okay. Uh, hi. Mm -hmm. Uh, what? Okay. Wuh. I'm suspicious. Yeah, what? You have a... Yeah, I like how she's like, what? Wallflowers for galaxy team folk only. We don't have seats for outsiders. Move along. Aw. The wind uh. blow noise. Oh, this is the other player character when when you play as a boy. Uh, I mean, we do look super weird. That's true. Comparatively. Who in the world are you? And what's that bizarre garb you're wearing? Oh, you're very British. Oh, yes. <laughs> a Pokemon could slice right through those flimsy excuses for clothes. Hmm, for, go for you to get in here, someone must have vouched for you. Yeah, wait, we got into town just fine, so why are yeah, they being weird we that were, now that we're here? Because we were with the dude, but the dude's not with us right now. Sure, but how would we have gotten into town otherwise? Yeah, but this guy's being a dick about it being specially only for the people part of that team. I don't think everyone in the town is part of that team. I guess. Oh, he's from another region, too. Oh, wow. Not the most reliable sort, though, letting Pokemon <laughs> run off and give them the slip and all. Well, okay, so he's not respected. Yeah. Three more of them got away just a while ago. Oh, so he's lost other ones before? I think I think the um I think he's talking about the ones that we just got back. No, I'm just saying, but like Oh, that this is a common thing. More yeah. like But the Professor, well look at those shoes. It was the professor, yeah. yeah. It's just as Ray says. Ray. So Ray is Japanese for zero, which is kind of interesting. 
I, I wonder if that would have been the female character if we'd picked male. Probably, or yeah. Ray is also the name of the zero, the zero from Mega Man like character in Mighty Number no. Nine. Uh, I forget what it was short for. It was short for something, but I'm a clumsy sort of fella, to put it mildly. Ah! Duh! <laughs> ah! I didn't realize you were listening to me diss you. Yep. <laughs> I do like that cape, though. That's a sweet cape. It's not a cape. It's a lab or, coat. No, 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 no. On Ray. Oh, oh. I, not cape. Scarf. He's got a scarf. Yeah. I, I don't like, know what why. What the fuck are you why. talking about? I no think because it was behind him, my brain said cape. cape. But everything will be quite all right now. Joanne here has agreed to help us with our Pokedex. Oh, is Ray going to be our rival? Yeah, she's going seems to join like the. It. Yeah, okay. Because he does not seem pleased. Yeah. <laughs> Who the fuck is this now? Oh. oh. Angry. Resting oh, bitch dear. face. My goodness. I think he's supposed to look like, um, was it Cyrus? Who is the leader of Team Galactic in. I'm just saying, the you know, present. resting bitch face happens to yeah. everyone, right? Or can happen to anyone. Silene, I guess? So yeah, Silene. I feel like I'd go with Silene. Cyrus, yeah. Possibly she's Cyrus's great ancestor. Uh, presumably, yeah. Of some kind. Great times 50 grandmother. Um, I feel like that's the implication here anyway. Yeah. He likes to feed and housing in exchange for your ongoing labor. I mean, That is usually be, how nice. it works, yes. Be 15 or so. All right. How dare you? I'm 27. <laughs> Baby, uh, I don't know how to break it to you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I haven't been 27 for a few years there, my darling. Let's see if you prove yourself worthy. Oh, a most reasonable decision, Captain. Now, would you care to join us for a meal? I'm sure you've got plenty of questions for our visitor. All right. I see. She's a lone wolf. Dun dun. Lone wolf wearing fashionable uh, hemisphere shoes. Aloof as always, I see. Well, no matter. The rest of us could share a meal and some pleasant conversation then, eh? <laughs> Don't beat that drum while I'm talking to you. Ooh, potato mochi. How Man, would that... What would that even... Ta like, I guess I always think of mochi as ice cream. But no, mochi, mochi ice cream is a thing, but mochi is just the, is the wrapper thing. Okay, I guess that's fair, yeah. So it'd, it'd be kind of a dumpling, basically. Yeah, similar, I suppose. Just kind of a denser sort of dumpling. The mochi is the dough that it's wrapped in. I, I guess I that's true, I believe, yeah. if I recall correctly. So it should be, you know, like He's potato got wrapped in that dough and then steamed, fried, whatever. I'm not sure exactly how it, or, you know, yeah. souped. Not sure how it's cooked usually. The one people call the space time rift. So oh, like, oh, so everybody knows about it. Yeah, okay. if you're calling it that, then you're aware that there's some distortions. My friend yeah, fell right out of it. Yeah. Was that was that a joke? <laughs> like he he, he just said yes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Come now, I'm a scientist. Which, depending on how you use that emphasis, is a very different sentence. My job is to observe and explain any and all phenomena. I concern myself only with facts. Uh, now you already uh, know there are many Pokemon here in the His Hisui region. Sure, they're all over the place. In the grass, the forest, the ocean. It's up to uh, us in the Survey Corps to study them and figure out what kind of creatures they are. Well, we know this much. Pokemon are terrifying creatures. One of them's got, like, big round eyes. And another one's got a poofy tail. Right. Dun dun dun. Yeah, right. I like how it's like wooden chimes. Not wooden chimes. Wooden um Yeah, well, like wooden wind bamboo chimes. Growing back there. What do you mean? No, no, no. Listen to the sound, ready? That. Oh, oh, okay. I, 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 was, I like, didn't understand what you were Sorry, talking yeah. about. Sorry, yeah. All right. You've been a Pokémon research in earnest. Ah! Guess I was lucky when we managed to catch a single wild Pokémon while fending off their attacks. Ah, well, to be perfectly fair, the Pokemon that fled to the beach weren't on the attack. But the key to catching Pokemon is getting close enough to aim your Pokeball well. And it seems our new friend is fearless enough to do just that. Does the Survey Corps really have the leeway to be enjoying a leisurely meal with his outsider? Wow. Your Go captain fuck just yourself. All right. Your captain just ordered ten whole portions of potato mochi, you know? The slow progress on that Pokedex of yours clearly has her on edge. Is that a mustache? Like, what... Because then there's the green strap that looks like it's a strap for a hat, but yeah, I guess that's also a chin strappy thing. It. 
because like it's the green of the mustache, but he's also got the little beard thing. Yeah. And like I don't, uh, the, but the hair looks green. It's so confusing. I think it's supposed to be a handkerchief tied over the head based it is, on definitely. what's going on yeah. at the back. So like I guess the chin strap is hair, but right? yeah, I have no fucking clue what's going on either. It is nice that because there's far like there's not really like cities proper cities or anything you can see the stars more clearly at night you're awfully relaxed about this you do know that we won't get get to have joanne join the survey corps unless she passes the trial not to worry i have complete confidence in joanne's skills what oh that was a door it sounded like something stomping yeah very strange oh my god at least we'll provide you with a place to sleep you may use our quarters there in the middle of the grass. Oh, Just that lie building. on the ground. It's yeah, fine. <laughs> like they couldn't have, Don't worry about it. They couldn't have made it. that first half of the expository <laughs> shot there any less like clear what we were looking it's at. It's like, um, excuse me, where do you want me to go? <laughs> Jesus, if we fail the trial, they're just kicking us out of town. Perhaps death. Just That's a little like, yeah, and then you might die, because go fuck yourself. Yeah. Captain Sarlene's like, he's sweet in a way. They're both plenty harsh. Yeah, she's like, yeah, by the way, that might just, you know, be how she is. Yeah, right? Oh, my God. <laughs> it's a good thing one can't fall out of the futons we sleep in here. I imagine no friend has been had enough falling for one day. Oh, just you watch. A futon <laughs> oh, is very I'll easy to out. fall out of. Ah, <laughs> uh, another close-up. Still, people falling from the sky? That's some kind it's of story. Just the weirdness of the way it's so frozen. Yeah, there's not like any like wavering to the me. to the crackle going on there. All right. Let's see what we got in here. Are there like outfits we can can change into or something? This is a pretty... Uh, I guess it's not really our quarters. Like, we're staying here tonight, but it's not like we live yeah, in Yeah, it's this. not like ours permanently. Ooh. Store lots and lots of items in it. Oh, I, I suspect it will eventually be... Uh, sure, sure. I, I'm just saying currently, though, we don't own it. I, yeah. But I feel like that's... Yes. We're going to... I feel like that's going to come as we go. And we have, we have to pass the test first. They yeah. don't know if we're about to die. They're not going to give us room... <laughs> Oh, yeah, and save AKA off AKA save, that. yep. Yeah, that's fair. It's pretty obvious stuff. Uh, right. What else do we got in our dresser? Clothing. Nice fire on the sunken hearth. Can keep... I get a little kitchen, the room too. Heated. I think that's kind of everything. I don't think there's anything else for us to really... It's the bed, which is where we're supposed to go. Oh, our five principles. Behave with courtesy to others. Superiors are owed you respect. Likes and dislikes are a luxury ill-afforded. Mm. Those who are weaker must be helped. Huh. That's nice, at least. Even though you're going to throw us out, difficulties must be faced head on. Oh, mirror. We're a stranger, Change outfit. But yeah. It's full-length mirror. We might not have okay. other outfits yet, I guess. Might not be until we pass the trial. Plain old stones. I'm confused. It says both that there's some lovely stones, but also plain. I think as opposed to, like, evolutionary stones. I guess. All right. Until tomorrow morning? Yes. Can please continue story? Yes, please. Yeah. This one definitely seems more RPG than... Yeah, a little bit more story. Oh, dear. We're going to get friends? Oh, no. Yeah, I've been more people coming Barrel. in from other realities. Oh, no. It's Giovanni of Team oh, Rainbow shit. Rocket. Oh, oh. That feels like, like the tree should be burning down or something. Jeebus. Yeah. That wasn't good. Oh, Watch out, there's a Gigantamax pseudo Wudo attacking!